Hey everybody, it's Kevin with Interstate Explorers, and in today's video we're going to be looking again at the black tink override valves. So, let's get into it. Alright, so there's two basic locations for where the black tink override can be. And they both work, just one will be a little bit easier, I guess, to access than the other. In a previous video, we showed you that the black tank override system can be found inside the main storage area, but the other spot can be found underneath the trailer. So let's go ahead and take a look down here. And I've already opened this hatch up, but as you can see, there's this Velcro door down here, and I'll kind of zoom out so we can kind of get a better idea of where exactly this is. And you can access the black tank override um, down from this door, which is just held together by Velcro. There's the black tank right there, and there's the tires just to give you kind of more of a frame of reference. So let's crawl underneath and let's get a little bit closer. Okay, so the first thing that's kind of annoying is that this Velcro is not quite the highest quality, as you can see. Um, it's basically just Velcro tape and it's coming off there. So I'm going to have to figure out, maybe put some glue down to get that Velcro tape on there better. And we're having the same kind of issue down here with the reverse side of the Velcro. So that's kind of the first thing that's, that's annoying about this. So I'm going to see if I can get that fixed up and then we'll take a look at the black tank override. Okay. And there it is. There's our black tank override valve right there. You would just have to, let's see if I get my finger there remove and pull and that's going to be your override system and then on the other side over here there's going to be your other tank override right there so once you're down here i mean that's a pretty simple thing to do but you know i am fully on my back right now and um this clearance space is not very wide so you definitely have to do a bit of crawling to get here and uh, certainly for somebody that is older than me or uh, maybe disabled uh, this would be a very challenging task uh, for somebody uh, to do like I said in the old video this these are I guess easier to access um, but you do have to do some crawling so that's not great so uh, long story short um, I'm still gonna say the same thing I said before I'm just going to hope that these don't fail because this is going to be a bit of a pain to be able to fix that, especially if you're camping and the ground's muddy or just dirty. So you definitely don't want that. All right. And as always, we want to hear from you. Is this black tank override system being hard to access? Is this something that's a deal breaker for you? Is it just a minor inconvenience? Do you have an electronic valve on your RV? Uh, we want to know from you. So let us know in the comments. Make sure to like and subscribe and keep exploring.